The Royal Navy's Wildcat helicopter, a multi-role machine that operates from frigates and destroyers. It provides commanders with a flexible attack capability, but only if it's operational. At RNAS Yeovilton, engineers are using a new artificial intelligence tool called Motherload to help with maintenance. So when maintenance is being done on the Wildcat helicopters, huge amounts of maintenance data is produced. Now Motherload is all about using artificial intelligence to ensure that the work being done is more efficient and smarter. We record lots of information to do with the aircraft and how we maintain it. Motherload effectively takes that information, applies some really clever data processing and calculations, and then it displays that data in a really easy to use format. And it allows us to understand uh, on a, a really grand scale how we maintain our aircraft or focused in on a specific tower number and a specific issue. So the overall goal is to increase aircraft availability. That's partly done by predicting when parts could become faulty so engineers are ready to replace them. But it's not all. The tool will allow us to uh, conduct that analysis if a component fails. Um, so if a tail rotor blade fails after 100 flying hours, for example, we can compare that on the tool to see if that is as expected, if it's exceeded our expectations or if it's um, not reached our expectations in terms of reliability. And then from there we can liaise with the uh, industry to see if potentially a modification might be required in order to improve the reliability and serviceability of, of those assets. The Minister for Defence Procurement visited RNAS Yeovilton to get an insight into how the new AI tool works. You might argue these are sort of things that perhaps don't get the attention they should. We often, you know, when we talk about defence, we're talking about the next new thing we're going to buy or, you know, the more glamorous side of this, the big shiny platforms. Actually, maintenance support, as anyone who serves in the armed forces knows, is absolutely critical. So hearing from the Navy, given that they're going to be out at sea, that's incredibly beneficial. Because if they're out there and they've run out of parts, they've got a real issue. It's expected Motherload will be rolled out across all Royal Navy helicopters by the end of the year. Claire Sadler, Forces News, RNAS Yeovilton. Thanks for watching. For more from Forces News, like and subscribe to our channel.